Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to enter your new product key on your Windows 10 device. This video includes the instructions for the devices listed below. This portion of the video will show you how to enter your product key for your i12 and i15 devices. First, go ahead and tap on the icon on your desktop that is labeled Control Center. This icon is pink and white. If you do not see it on your desktop, go ahead and type in Control in the search box at the bottom left corner, and you will see it listed under Best Match. Once this loads, tap on iSeries product key on the left. At the top, you will see your original iSeries product key. Down at the bottom, go ahead and enter the new iSeries product key that you received from customer service. To pull up your on-screen keyboard, tap on the keyboard icon down at the bottom right corner. If you do not see this keyboard icon, press and hold on the time and date at the bottom right corner for five seconds and let go. About halfway down the menu, you will see an option for Show Touch Keyboard button. Make sure that that is checked. Now, go ahead and enter your new iSeries product key. Once your new product key has been entered, you will get a notification that says the product key was successfully added. Go ahead and hit the X at the top right corner to close this window. Tap on your Windows icon down at the bottom left corner, hit the power icon, and hit restart. Once the device restarts, you are finished. Now I'm going to show you how to enter your product key on an i13, i16, i110, ND, ND7, EM12, and an iMobile Plus. First, go ahead and double tap on the Configuration Manager icon on your desktop. This is green and white. If you do not see this icon on your desktop, in the search box at the bottom left corner, type in Config, and you will see it on the list under Best Match. Once you've opened this up, you will be greeted with a welcome screen. Next, you will see a green Get Started button. Go ahead and tap on that button. On the next page, you will see your serial number at the top. It should automatically be entered. In the product key field, go ahead and erase your old product key that is listed. Now you will want to enter the new product key that you received from customer service. There are two ways to do that. If you received a QR code, go ahead and tap Scan QR Code and this will bring up your device's camera. From here, you can point your device's camera to the QR code that was provided. It should continue automatically once it is scanned. The other way is to tap manual key entry and enter the key by hand. Go ahead and tap next and then accept. Once your device reboots, the product key has been successfully added.